hello guys welcome back and another series of tutorial for redmi 10x diamond city 820 this is a 5g phone and it's very rare and seldom people use custom rom on this uh, MediaTek Diamond City 820 and the custom ROM are available for this model since June this year so how to flash the ROM the ROM link which recovery to use and which best ROM especially the MIUI ROM okay let's begin this is Xperia X2 to flash the stock ROM on this uh, XZ2 I'm not a US citizen XZ2 XZ2 already on the stock Sony UI I want to test it on stock, everything stock. Test this uh, emulator, especially. And also, I'm testing a uh, PUBG new state. Since the PUBG new state blocking using custom ROM. And also, my LG. V50 also back to stock this is the stock LG MIUI eh, sorry stock LG UI MIUI always MIUI uh, PUBG new state not a problem for this device SD855 and 845 Okay, keep aside this two and FOD working fine Wi-Fi working fine Bluetooth working fine everything fine Let me Tanek The ROM are pixel experience. Link for the ROM in the description. So far, I'm testing this ROM for about one week. No major problem, no major bug. The camera you can use the gcam whatever gcam you can find which one better that's up to you the rom very fluid so far so good Wi-Fi 5G 
my data line uh, no sim card inside sorry for that but I test it before it's okay voice over LTE that one I'm not sure I haven't tested it okay let's start from the beginning flashback the MIUI ROM on this Redmi 10X the tool this MediaTek it's very easy to break it so the safest tool to use without asking for authorize mm. is this tool Xiaomi ADB Fastboot 2 and the ROM uh, Fastboot ROM Uh, this uh, this is the ROM passport ROM don't use the SP flash tool for this MediaTek use the passport mod and the passport ROM to flashback the stock MIUI ROM it is recommended to use the Android 10 about the anti rollback on this uh, Redmi 10 X 5G mm, I am not sure but there is no anti rollback if I am not mistaken let's see it's one If it is 4, you flash the 3, then that one will be blocked. 1, that means no roll back. Okay. Why my camera? What happened? Let's use the Wi-Fi. because these tool are connecting to my Surya this one is a POCO X3 NFC okay we need to boot the port into fast boot first switch off it to boot into fast boot very easy on all Xiaomi device just volume uh, power volume minus volume plus hold volume minus press power still holding this one and one is reboot release this power button holding the volume minus you get into a fast boot mode like this release the power now you are inside a fast boot mode just connect your USB cable 
make sure your driver everything are properly installed let me check my driver if the video are too long sorry for that better be sorry see the foot loader this is the Download your ROM. I'm using the MIUI 1206, the fastboot ROM. Link for the fastboot ROM also will be given in the description. This one is Android 10. You can press the Android 11, it's up to you, the fastboot. But better use the 10 in case you want to go back to Android 10 the tool now is detecting atom and this is the pawn that we want to flash in this tool don't use SP flash tool Hold on, because my camera. Okay, this tool very simple. Already unlocked. This tool also can be used to unlock your boot loader. If your phone can boot into the fast boot, then use this tool. It will automatic unlock it without authorize no need to log into your show me account where your rom once more time use this second one flash image this one disable the anti run back it's still very straightforward, it's still very simple to use. Where's your fastboot ROM? My fastboot ROM over here. Atom 1206. Select folder. The folder already select. Method clean install. If you want to unlock, uh, relock it back, just clean install and lock. Select ROM, clean install. This is how to flash back the stock MIUI ROM on any NIUI device, Xiaomi device, whatever device. This is the safest tool to use without login into your account, without authorize. Now, flash. This is a MediaTek, even Qualcomm, but make sure your driver are properly installed. Elliot, Poco F3, Atom is Redmi 10X, 5G, Begonia, Redmi Note 8 Pro, this is Android. 9, Android 10, and Android 11, 3 version of Android. This uh, Redmi Note 8 Pro, no anti rollback. I think this uh, Atom also, no anti rollback. The Redmi 10X 5G, it's flashing. 
so the fast food mod don't use EDL on this MediaTek that very risky beryllium pokoe fun ginkgo red me not 8 lavender red me not 7 me a3 on glide red me 7 surya mi6 umi mi10 this is the fast food rom link for the rom passport ROM you can select which version you want to flash since this uh, Redmi 10X 5G is a Chinese version over here only for global version the ROM download somewhere else also I will give the ROM a link This is the all the ROM for the Redmi 10X 5G recovery. The recovery after this, I am I'm going to update the this ROM. This are the older one version 10 Android version 10 and the MIUI are version 2.06. I'm going to flash the recovery ROM, the MIUI 12.5.4. If you got the latest one, you can revert back to 12.5.4 by flashing the recovery ROM via TWRP or the other the other TWRP are Orange Fox. This is the only version for custom ROM and the custom ROM for this Atom uh, over here Redmi 10X you can download it download the ROM and download VB Meta this one for Uh, boot secure 2.0 to disable it we almost finished flashing and right now it's flashing the super image link for the custom ROM pixel experience this is the on August finish already. The pawn will boot after this. Where you see the Chinese only five language, two Chinese, uh, one Arab, this one Korean, I think, one uh, simplified Chinese, and English, Chinglish. Log to my Wi Fi. country if you want to log in your account you can change your country and I don't want to lock my into my account
a lot of blood wear see everything Chinese sure this is a Chinese model no global model for this uh, Redmi 10X 5G the current are uh, 1206 there is an update after this to 1202 1205 1254 the only version for the best ROM the MI ROM are uh, used the 12 5.4 if you want to put into the recovery if you want to see the stock MI recovery reboot hold the volume plus while reboot volume minus to get into fast boot volume plus into recovery if you want to see the stock MII recovery this is the MI stock recovery Ni hao hao ma li yao a lao a ok reboot oops sorry this is the flash mod ok now boot back to fast boot Wait, wrong button again back to fast boot because we want to flash the custom recovery to flash the MIUI 12.5.4 ok already the driver are already there the ADB minimal ADB they call it and also for this file maybe no need to just get the minimal ADB put your recovery inside that folder and open the command inside this folder Okay, now we're going to flash the TWRP because this TWRP for Android 10 Orange Fox for Android 11 because right now my device are still Android 10 I can't flash the Android 11 recovery it will not boot so for the best ROM at the current my Android uh, Android 10 I flash the Android 10 TWRP so fast boot oh sorry fast boot flash recovery space or you type the TWRP dot IMG or just pull this over here and enter ah why you say it corrupt okay one more time pass boot flash recovery 
www.rp.img every command is space one space one space one space and enter it flashing now your rom your download you can put into your sd card or internal if you can find it inside the internal if you know how to find it but better use sd card or usb drive we already flashed the the twrp so right now hold the volume plus and the power button hold volume plus hold it power button until it reboot into recovery the custom recovery just hold it it will reboot release the power button still holding the volume plus not it power up hold the power button again just hold the volume plus you will it will reboot to the TWRP it's Android 10 TWRP we're going to press the MIUI 12.5.4 I just plug in my USB drive whether it detect or not install select storage USB OTG yes it detect we going to update the the current ROM to the version 12.5.4 so wipe add one double big and cache only wipe these two only so install atom 12.5.4 I hope you can see 12.5.4 flash if your phone already update to 12.5.7 uh, you need to revert back to 12.5.4 if you use the 12.5.7 as the best ROM because we need the, all the file from the MIUI in order to boot the custom ROM the 12.5.7 you will get error on your Wi-Fi on your data line especially the modem the custom ROM are based on 12.5.4 not the 7 the 7 are latest one this uh, kernel already update to the latest kernel that's why they are using better use the 12.5.4 because the custom ROM are based on the 12.5.4 the kernel if you use the latest kernel you will get error also on the camera maybe bluetooth now we are updating manually to 12.5.4 from the android 10 with flash using the flash tool before this
Dead dead. Go back. Install. Image. We're going to flash the BB Meta. BB Meta. This BB Meta. Reboot system. Updating it to Android 11, 12.5.4. After, after it reboot, we flash the orange box recovery. This one for Android 11. Because we already updated it to Android 11, we need to use the Android 11. You see the boot animation on MIUI 12 Android 11 are different compared to the Android 10. Now, the point five point four Android eleven before this Android ten. So power up. Power off, put back to recovery. We want to flash the orange box. Call volume minus. Fast boot. Connect your cable. My camera will disconnect. Okay, over here, open the command inside your folder, the ADB folder. Now we're going to flash the orange box recovery. Pass, put, well, flash. Eleven dot img. This is the file name of Fox Eleven, the recovery name, and password flash recovery, and the file name. Enter. It flashing. Now, already done. We have to boot back to the recovery. Now we're going to flash custom ROM okay same thing as before this uh, volume plus and power button Please don't use SP Flash tool or any Xiaomi Flash tool. You will get into trouble a lot. Now we are using Orange Fog Android 11. My ROM are inside my USB drive. Whether it detect my my drive, USB or TD, no, it's not detecting. I have to reboot the uh, reboot back to recovery. Reboot to recovery. In order for the recovery to detect my. OTG Okay 
check the file why why my OTC it don't detect micro SD also not detecting OTG internal ok ok never mind after this we reboot it now we need to fly uh, the wipe Dalvik data cache don't wipe the internal Dalvik data cache just just ignore that uh, red error and then format data yes come on need to reboot reboot to recovery not detecting my SD card oh sorry no SD card inside my OTG USB drive thumb drive come on OTG yes now it detect <laughs> very funny pixel experience plus atom android 11 Pixel Experience Plus Atom Flash Same procedure, same procedure as as you place the MIUI 12.5.4 just now. After you flash the from flash BB Meta. This BB Meta this file uh, from here A link for this also I will give this is the MIUI the BB, BB meta image this is to disable the verified boot 2.0 the security now back flash the BB meta choose BB meta okay reboot if you want to root flash magis if you don't want to root just reboot that's it So far, no update. This is the latest. Uh, only three version one 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 zero one 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 three. Only three version. I think this one is a Chinese fellow. We are already in a custom ROM this is a pixel experience plus my Wi-Fi don't use to 12.5.7 use 12.5.4 as your best ROM There is another This is a stock pixel experience Android 11 
although it's stock but still considered as a custom ROM. Everything fine for the Google Fit. Uh, 